How's it going, everyone? I'm Nostalgia Dave, and welcome back aboard the Nostalgia Train. So, we're in a really bad version of the school. What is happening? Hello? Was that Psycho? Uh, she already said it, so I don't need to. <laughs> This isn't good. Yeah, no kidding. We basically just had an earthquake. You expected that? Why, why would you expect this to be good? Ow. Oh. That did not look like it felt good. Whew. That really hurt. My ankle's in pretty bad shape. I'd imagine. What's this? Heavenly Post. Third student reported missing. One by one, the young students of Heavenly Host blank school seem to be disappearing as now a third student has joined the ranks of the missing. Heavenly Host Elementary, the school we were talking about quite recently at that. Oh boy. Classmates testified that fifth grader Blank was on her way home from school but got separated from her friends in the hall and hasn't been seen since. Wow. Police are investigating the possibility of a serial kidnapping and have assigned countless investigators to the case in hopes of a speedy resolution. However, Ten days have already passed since the first disappearance, giving parents and classmates ample cause for concern. Great. Psycho? Thank goodness. She's still breathing. Psycho, come on, Psycho, wake up. <laughs> Sleeping on the job here. What job? I, I don't know. Inspectigator? That's, that's a job title. <clears throat> okay, she's awake. Hi. Huh? Naomi? What's up? Don't you what's up me? I thought you were dead. Hmm? Uh... Where, where are we? I f beats me, Psycho. What's going on? That's what I'd like to know. Yeah, say I, I second that. Well, technically I third that, but still. There, I made the sound. I don't have to. <laughs> they ain't budging. These windows are sealed up tight. And it's pitch black out there. I can't make heads or tails of what I'm seeing. What the hell is going on? Beats me, Naomi. Well, this is clearly a school building. Well, yeah. Although it's kind of decrepit and destroyed. Don't the desks seem unusually small to you, though? Okay, yeah, this is Heavenly Host Elementary. Like an elementary school. Yeah, gee, I wonder which one. An elementary school? Can't be... Can it? Yeah, well, we just read proof that it was, Naomi. Were you not paying attention? <sighs> what is it? How did I forget to read that? The printout on the wall? It says Heavenly Host Elementary. Notice to all faculty and students. Heavenly Host? Isn't that the elementary school that preceded... Kisaragi Academy? 
The one that was shut down and demolished? That's not creepy at all. God, what's happening? Where the hell are we? Uh, you just answered your own question. And where are our friends? I miss Yui. Calm down, psycho. <laughs> I don't care that that's her name. That is still a statement that you should never put side by side to a normal person. Don't get so worked up. <sighs> Sorry. Seiko and I just stood there in silence, hand in hand. It was the first time in my life that I've been shaking so hard. I could hear my teeth chatter. I become completely lightheaded. I couldn't even think straight, much less wrap my brain around what was happening to us. I kept telling myself it's all a dream, some horrible nightmare. But no matter how hard I wished for it, I just couldn't wake up. Believe it or not, you're not asleep. And the silence was the worst part of all. Yeah, silence is the worst part of any horrors situation. I couldn't take it anymore. I had to say something. Anything. Hey. I don't have the slightest idea what's going on. But how about we try finding a way out of here? Probably a good idea. The psycho says let's get out. Let's go. <laughs> Oh, you mean the name Psycho. That's, oh, yeah, no, no, no. I'm talking about the other type of Psycho. We can't just stand here quaking in terror. We need to do something, you know? Besides, I don't want to be in this creepy place any longer than I have to. But the windows are all sealed shut. And I don't just mean they're stuck or locked. It's like they're decorations on the wall. I don't even think they can open. Is it even possible to leave this building? Probably not. I'm not sure. But there might be an entrance way or an emergency exit or something. Some means of getting outside. Oh, jeez. You're right. And it's a lot better than just standing around. I feel like I'm going to go all loony in here if we keep this up. Aren't you already? I mean, your name is Psycho, for heaven's sake. <laughs> okay, then. First step is to leave this room. We gotta keep our spirits up. After all, it's probably not just the two of us in here. <laughs> You're not wrong. The others have to be around somewhere, right? I like the music in the background. Yeah, if we can reunite with them, we can get rid of them and then get the hell out of here. Oh, wait. Oh, never mind. We'll find a way out of here together. Okay, that's pretty close to what I said, actually. Except, you know, not get rid of them. Psycho's ahead. <laughs> Don't look at me like that. That's the spirit. I had no reason to believe any of what I just said. I was probably delirious, to be honest. But I knew that if I didn't act, I'd start to go mad. I'd start to scream. I'd be inconsolable. So, in desperation, I put on the strongest front I could manage. What in the... Character introductions. I don't care. I could talk and see... Wait. Who's this guy, actually? Oh. Okay. If 
you guys want to read it, just pause the video. I don't care. Okay, so that's... Okay, that's Yuka. Maybe I already do know of all these guys. This is Naomi? No, this is Psycho. That probably means this one's Naomi. Yeah. And this one? Satoshi. Okay, this one's Satoshi. This is Miss Yui. I forget your name. Yoshiko. Or Yoshiki. You are Ayumi. And you? Mayu. Okay, we're getting out of here. Yeah, let's get back to the actual game, please. Come on, Naomi. Let's go. Right. I love how behind my head it just like, shows characters in the party. Wait a sec. What? Ow! Another earthquake? No! Oh, boy. Is it over? Whew. I don't think either of those were earthquakes, kids. <laughs> I've had enough. Yeah, me too. Hey! Person next to me. Can we get out of here? Can you open a doorway for us? Uh, Psycho, there's no one next to you. Oh. I knew that. Let's just get out of this room. Uh. What? What's wrong? What's wrong is we can't go anywhere. This hallway looks totally different than it did before. But maybe the earthquake made more of the floor collapse? Yeah. M maybe. The gap is relatively narrow here. Seems crossable, but it's a little too wide to risk jumping. Well, boo. What about this? So, wait. Okay. Not going that way, I guess. There's a yellow fluid congealing inside of... Ew. Ew. Is that... What is that? What the heck is this? Pete? Ew, don't say that. Quite frankly, it probably is. If you should encounter any dead ends, be sure to examine any spots on the walls or floors nearby that seem particularly. Like right here? Examine the walls, it says. Examine things that seem a bit off, it says. What does that do for me? Absolutely nothing. Uh, hey, Naomi. Hmm? Is something wrong with your leg? Oh, yeah. I was so freaked out, I forgot all about it. I think I sprained my ankle when I fell. Well, that's not good. Will you be okay? I can walk at least. I'm sure it'll heal on its own. Yeah, but you shouldn't push yourself. Here, lean on my shoulder, okay? Okay, thanks. There's a loose board lying on the ground here. Take it with you? Yeah. <sighs> I think I know what to do with that. Just want to make sure I'm not missing anything. Alright. So, top or bottom? Ultimate question of any person's <laughs> mind. Hey, Naomi. What about that loose board we found? Think it would support our weight? We could try. The bridge? Hmm, I don't know. It seems
seems kind of beat up, but I guess it is pretty solid. Yeah, let's try it. Blue sport has been set in place. No, oh, no, that works fine. I guess if we want to see what's south, we could always just go the other way. Unless there's another loose board somewhere. Hello? Can't, never mind, can't go that way. That's blocked off right now. What's in here? Okay, you guys can't hear it, but, um... that okay moving on what ow what's wrong Naomi I know I'm a psychopath you don't have to shove me to the side look I just like you almost pushed Fred off the edge who the hell is Fred Look, I, I don't care. Look over there. Aren't those the bones? Like, people bones? Ew. That drawing was way too well done. What? Why? Why is there a dead person here? Wait. Let me look at them more closely. Why would you want to do that? Maybe they're not real. Oh, like a skeleton in a classroom. Okay, that makes sense. No. Shells are filled to overflowing with long black hairs. That's disgusting. Rows of dead bugs are neatly arranged on each shelf. Okay. What does it say? Emily Host Elementary. Notice to all faculty and students. Uh, and then uh, written over it says, I'm going to kill you. Psychopath is real. I'm going to leave. Uh, they really are somebody's bones. Okay. Psycho. Don't. Ah, uh, yes? You two are new victims, are you not? <laughs> Alright, we're both psychotic. I'm hearing voices from the skeleton. Who are you? And now I'm talking to the skeleton. I was brought here against my will and confined just like you. Confined? Do you mean there's no way out? I'm afraid not. This school exists in a reality all its own. Cut off from the world you know. That's not good. So why have we been brought here? They brought you. They're constantly bringing new victims into this school. More and more all the time. Sinless innocence, one after another. This is a cursed, multi-dimensional nexus. Multiple planes of existence, all piled on top of one another. Created by powerful, vengeful spirits. Closed space, or perhaps... Closed spaces, you and we as well are the unlucky victims of an inescapable abduction. Closed spaces? No wonder they're being psychos. Indeed. And it seems you two are not the only ones to have been brought here. I'm sensing numerous others. What? Does that mean everybody else 
is here too? Are they okay? I wonder. So our friends are in this school too? I don't know the exact number, but I do know that others were pulled into these spaces at the same time as you. They are definitely in this school. Oh my god! That's such good news! Naomi, they're here! We're not alone! That means Moshida's here too. I'll bet that makes you feel a lot better, right? However, you cannot meet them. Why not? They are definitely in this school, but the space they occupy differs from the space we occupy. If you wish to see your friends, you must find some means of entering their space, or bringing them into this space. Even then, escape is nigh impossible, but at least you'll be able to die together. Wow! Oh, oh god. Is there no way out of here then? You said we were brought here by vengeful spirits, right? Who are they? Why have they taken us? I don't know. Neither the motives of our captors, nor a means of escaping this hell. And all I know is that with some effort, you can at least live out your days together. In the same space. That alone is a fate worth fighting for. Two heads are better than one. Your chances and your opportunities are so much greater than working together. I read that wrong, probably. Uh, <laughs> although it's the correct statement for those who are psychotic, so yeah, we're going to go with that. Do whatever you can. Find a way out of here. Don't end up like us. Doors unlocked. No. I noticed it. It was behind my head, but I noticed it. Hi, who are you? N Naomi, run. We have to get out of here now. Uh, okay. Okay, I'm not even in control on that one. Who was that? <coughs> Are you alright, Psycho? Yeah. What the hell was that? A child? Spirit? It did kind of... Whoa. I never believed in ghosts before. Is this really happening? There were definitely ghosts in there. First time I've ever seen something like that. BS, psycho! So you saw it too, right? Yeah. We were talking to it. I just don't understand any of this. Except that there's no easy way out for us. Like it or not, we're stuck in here. It, it'll be okay. Let's just, you know, march on with our heads held high. Quite literally, we'll just hold our heads in the sky as we're watching while we're, we're marching around headless. That's totally a normal thing to do. It's something. Anyway, one way or the other, I'm going to leave this video here. These psychos need to put their heads together and just make sure that they're not going any crazier than they already are. One more the other. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Corpse Party. Technically, this is the 2021 version, but I'm just going to go by Corpse Party anyway. Uh, if you liked this video, make sure to push that like button, and so far you can't sit it anymore. If you really liked it, consider subscribing to the channel. Have a suggestion for a horror RPG that you'd like to see on here, or any RPG or horror game in general. Let me know in the comments below. Want to check out another singular horror RPG I've done prior to this? Click the link at the bottom right of the corner to try and take you to that destination. 
If you missed any of the stops on this ride, click the link to cross right here and the train will take you there. In the meantime, this train's off to its next destination, but we hope to catch you guys in another ride. Bye!